Hello everyone, and welcome back to Cartography and Geography Club. Today, we're going to learn how to draw a map of Indonesia, a beautiful and diverse country located in Southeast Asia. Whether you're a student working on a project or just interested in geography, this step-by-step -step tutorial will help you create your very own map. Let's get started. Indonesia consists of over 17,000 islands. We'll focus on the major ones. Start by drawing Sumatra on the far left, Java beneath it, Kamatatan, also known as Borneo, in the northeast, Sulawesi to the north, and Papa, which is right next to Papua New Guinea, on the far east. These islands are the cornerstone of Indonesia's geography. Start by drawing a large rectangle in the center of your paper. This will be the outline of the Indonesian archipelago. It should be wider on the left side and narrower on the right side. Now, let's add the larger islands. Begin with Sumatra, located on the western side of the rectangle. Draw it as a slightly curved shape. Next, add Java, which is located to the east of Sumatra. Java is the most populous island in Indonesia. Draw it as a longer and thinner shape extending down towards the south. Moving to the northeast, draw the island of Kamitatan, also known as Borneo. It should be larger than Sumatra and have a distinct shape. Now let's draw Sulawesi, the island in the northeastern part of our rectangle. It has a unique shape with several peninsulas. To the east of Sulawesi, draw the island of Papa, which Indonesia shares with Papua New Guinea. It's a bit different in shape, so take your time with the details. Indonesia is made up of thousands of smaller islands. Use your pencil to sk lightly sketch in some of the smaller islands around the main ones we've drawn. Now, use your eraser to clean up any extra lines and refine the shapes of the islands. You can also lightly mark important cities like Jakarta, the capital on Java. And there you have it your very own map of Indonesia. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, found it helpful. Remember, practice makes perfect, so don't be afraid to give it another try. If you found this video useful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials like this. Thanks for watching and remember, never stop learning.